Hello everyone, this is A Plus and today we will talk about pregnancy in Japan. If you think you are pregnant, make an appointment to see a doctor to confirm your pregnancy. Pregnancy tests are not covered by uh, Japanese health insurance. The cost uh, varies depends on your condition and where you go. Fees are usually around 10,000 yen. Home pregnancy test kits are widely available at the drugstore starting around 1,000 yen. They are called uh, Nishin Kensayaku. First, you need a notification of pregnancy. Moms are required to uh, notify their local office after confirming their pregnancy. The expectant mother will receive a maternal and child health handbook. This handbook will keep a record of pregnancy checkups and the child's physical growth. You need to check this handbook to prenatals and baby checkup, as well as when your child gets vaccination. The cost of giving birth in Japan is, is around 500,000 yen, but your health insurance should be covered a part of this. You also need to take our parent classes. Your local health center provides prenatal parents classes for expecting parents. Midwives and nurses keep information about pregnancy, childbirth, and infant care. It is also a good opportunity to get to know other moms in your neighborhood. Classes held by a city health center are normally free of charge, but they are given in Japanese. Maternity hospitals provide our parents' classes as well. The cost varies depends on the hospital. Now first, you can check the obstetrics and gynecology department of the general hospitals. Some large hospitals have obstetrics and gynecology with labor and uh, delivery facilities. They provide pregnancy confirmation and prenatal checkup as well. Due to the uh, limited numbers of these hospitals, moms are often required to uh, make an appointment for delivery soon after the uh, confirmation of the pregnancy. Next, maternity hospitals. These are hospitals that specialize in pre and post pregnancy care. A maternity hospital referred to a maternity focused medical provider with more than 19 beds. The difference between a obstetrics and gynecology clinics is the size. These are bigger and have more staff equipment and facilities for prenatal care. Some maternity hospitals have addition departments such as pediatrics. Maternity hospitals are also rather rare, so moms are often required to make an appointment. Third, birth centers. Midwives manage pre and post mental checkups, labor and delivery. Birth center accept a small number of uh, pregnant women and have a family-oriented atmosphere and environment. They are contracted with the uh, obstetrics and gynecology and hospitals for uh, medical emergencies. So that's it for today. And if you like this video, make sure you leave a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, consider to subscribe. If you have any other questions, make sure to leave a comment down below. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.